Three individuals of interest have been identified as masterminds of the January 16 explosion, which rocked parts of the Bodija area of Ibadan, leaving more than five residents dead, while properties worth millions of naira were destroyed. Special Advisor to the Oyo State Governor on Security, Fatayo Owosheni, made this revelation shortly after the presentation of a comprehensive report to Governor Sheyi Makende at his office in Agodi where authorities uh, there promised to ensure swift prosecution of the suspects and a guarantee that such dastardly act won't be allowed to repeat. So amongst the three persons of interest that um, the investigating team uh, can prosecute now as those people that were in, in occupation of that house as of the time the incident happened. And based on the findings deducted from their interrogation and um, the investigation that um, was carried out. It is still an ongoing process. Some persons of interest weren't there when the incident happened and they were believed to have fled. The state and of course, through the necessary mechanism, um, has been after them. The state is aware that um, Mali, uh, where um, majority of these um, people of interest. The security team also revealed that the character of the explosive is known as water gel type based explosive and was triggered by an electric spark. Meanwhile, the engineering and medical team say 335 affected residents registered at the emergency situation center while properties stretching as far as 500 perimeters radius uh, from the epicenter were touched. What we do know that when people go through this kind of trauma, um, they suffer what is called PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorders. And a couple of people have come forward with features of PTSD. Some of them with insomnia, inability to sleep. Some of them are unduly irritable. Some of them are very agitated. We've seen marriages of 45 years where the husband is asking the wife, what exactly has gone wrong? And the wife is wondering, why has my husband, who has been so loving, suddenly become unapproachable? And some of them are broken down to tears spontaneously. Some have also become depressed because the uh, residents within and outside of the epicenter have come to the EOC to complain of respiratory problems, difficulty with breathing. In summary, I want you to know that we've visited 282 houses, and of all the 282 houses, only four are actually dangerous and... Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.